growing up in Japan, it's just like a growing up in like a world of Great Lana. It's very futuristic. We have a town like full of、uh, electric stores. You know, it's like neon signs, pretty lights, technology is there. You know, Japanese toilet, right? It's clean by itself. That kind of stuff. I don't know. It's like so close to my everyday life, but it's in me because that's how I grew up. Long story short, I became graphic designer, and as a foreigner living in New York, and be becoming an artist wasn't a choice. So I work for corporations, companies. But like I start getting itchy, I wanted to make some art. So I became a, a DJ. You know, making a video for club or experimental,、uh, working with experimental composers. And then software and technology advance, and then those lead me to the、uh, projection mapping and then、uh, editing mappings. My project get getting bigger and bigger every time, so this could be a biggest one so far. I'm dealing much better than used to be. I used to have a fevers <laughs> after I finished the installation, and I couldn't move from the bed. Now I don't have those. So I think I'm very getting adjust, you know, how to deal with pressures and all that. I have a special workshop. Work with like five to ten students doing a festivals. I teach everything I know. That's like my kids growing up. It's like really make me happy. If you know what you want, you can just keep on working on it, and it will come to you. And then that would be a challenge. And if you solve the challenge, or Face your challenge, you grow. So just like continuous, you can't stop. You just keep on doing what you love to do, and then believe in, believe, whatever you believe, whatever.